Oh, let's just, you know, let's just get into it. Let's get into it. I see your hair in my mouth. I sold, I had this, this assault rifle that I found, but I, I sold that to the merchant, got like 20,000 for it. Got new trinkets, got an Ashley trinket that helps with getting like 50. So if I use one, one green herb, I get 50% health just from one herb. So it'll bring me halfway. And then, so that helps a lot. And uh, I got uh, Luis, Luis. And that gets like me 20% extra with the guns, selling any kind of guns or whatever. And then I got this beetle. I don't know if I talked about the beetle, the beetle trinket. Those are both epics and that's a rare. So rare, two epics. I want to get all epics. But the, the uh, shooting gallery game is really fun. That's awesome. I, sometimes I play that just for, for hours just playing that. But uh, the beetle, you get like, so if I have like a full beaker, of yellow, red, and green. I get like $20,000. I can't even see the camera, sorry guys. I get like $20,000 um, for just selling one. So if I sell both, if I find two yellow herbs, I could sell this and get like $40,000 just from those two. If it's like that in that state with just a yellow or with a red and a green, I get like $4,000, which doesn't make sense, but hey. And if I sell a whole can of uh, first aid spray, I get like $5,000. So any health items, I get extra money for just having that beetle trinket, which is awesome. Let me save the game real quick. Now I'm broke again, because every time I get money, I get a decent amount of money, I always upgrade my guns. What did I do? I upgraded my stink, uh, my striker. I got rid of the riot. I, re I regret it, but I don't at the same time, if that makes sense. The striker's awesome. Still got the stingray. I'm probably never gonna get rid of that. I got a new scope for it. Got the high power scope excited about that been doing work with it and then i got the black black tail i probably won't i was gonna buy another handgun but i saw that matilda my last video i was talking to you guys about the matilda i really wanted that but then i looked into it you get it has three burst shots so you're wasting three bullets in just one shot i don't know if i like that that's you're gonna eat your ammo up doing that so i decided against that i got a bigger suitcase Straighten it out real quick. Gotta straighten the suitcase out. It just don't feel right. Unless I do. I'm very OCD about the suitcase. Um, what should we do? What should we do? Let's move this gunpowder like right here. Let's have all the sections. So my resources right here, my uh, explosive right here, my gunpowder right here, and then my ammo and then random junk right there. And then my medical supplies right over here. All my main things that I'm always gonna use, top, top section. That's a must. All right, so where are we going? We are supposed to go head for the throne room. Like I said, the last thing I did from this point on was beating the merciless knights or merciless knight the gold one he was not really on at all three shots with the striker took him down the armor man got handgun ammo so flash grenade and the resources to get should we try to get that real quick? let's go ahead and get that real quick we can never have too much um ammo and we're gonna need it i need to yeah i'm on zero for everything except for this let's do that Reload everything. Um, should we make some more? Oh yeah, let's make some more shotgun shells. Awesome. Needed that. That right there. Oh. All right, let's get this uh, armor. Or not armor. Let's go to the armory room. Like this get you real parched. Is it upstairs? Yeah, I think it's upstairs, dude. Damn it. Let me get up there again. I forgot. I don't know. This way. 
Yeah, got all the heads for that. I don't know if I said that or not. Got all the heads for that. Did all that before you lose? Before you did Ash, become Ashley, or you have to play as Ashley. I hope I don't have to do that again. I love. I think I recall you only had to be Ashley one time. Which that's just enough for me. One time, once is enough. Okay, where's the ammo that I saw on the map? Not seeing none. All right, there was ammo on this map, wasn't there? I know I wasn't seeing things. It should be in here. Is it on the rail? No, dude, there's nothing. Is it up here? No, because I just came from up there. Is it down there? Let's try here, down there again. Stupid. Stupid. Right there. And then where is the other? Flash grenade. Should be over here. Yo. Alright, let's roll. Look, like you have to go back and get that stuff. That stuff is important. Only amateurs don't go back and do and get, you know. If you see ammo, pick up, especially in a game like this, you gotta get any, any ammo you can get. Since you can't buy ammo, I wonder if you can start buying ammo from the merchant. Like, I wonder if there's a point you can. Cause that's where most of my, like most of my money, like I said, goes to upgrading my guns. I will gladly spend some money on ammo if I have to. But I still got a lot of this game left. Like I keep thinking, I'm like thinking, I'm like, yeah, I'm close to being in the end. No, I'm actually not. This game is so long, dude. I still gotta go to the island. I still have to, uh, you know, fight those one little. I don't know how to even explain it. The guys, you have to, you have to use a certain scope, uh, a certain scope to see where you should shoot them. You have to shoot them in the right spot, or you won't do nothing to them. They'll just eat their bullets. It's like jelly. I remember these. I forgot about these guys. I forgot about them. Fucking monsters. Yeah. I still got to, I guess I got a lot of this game left to do, so. Patience. Like I said. Well, I don't know if I said it, but maybe I was thinking it. <laughs> um, it's not the destination. It's the journey, not the destination. And that's just a fact. I oh, no. Can y'all hear the TV at all? Is it just me talking? I hope y'all can hear this. Hold on. Let me take these headphones off real quick. I could just be talking, y'all can hear nothing. Oh, you can hear it. You can hear it. Okay. Is that too low? Is this higher? So you can see the whole TV? Is that better? Hold on. There we are. Yeah, that's too, too high. I think that's just fine right there. Alright. Let's go. I'm gonna make this short for real because I still got a squat workout to do. I've been kind of procrastinating on that today. I gotta do, if I don't, look, if I tell myself, if I plan a workout for myself and I don't do it, like, I, my conscience will just destroy me. My conscience will destroy me if I don't. If I tell myself I'm gonna do something, then I have to do it or my conscience will make me feel like I'm just, the most useless scum of the earth, dude. Should I read this? I think we just got one, two, three, four. Oh, okay. 
I can read this. Let me read this. Let's read. July, two years since my awakening. Master Ramon has bestowed upon me a truly righteous undertaking to improve upon the flaws of our human form, to see perfection as observed in our arthropodal siblings? Okay, I don't know what that word was. If y'all can read that. Arthropodal siblings. I don't know how to say I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Like I said, I'm not the sharpest tool in the shed. To this cause, I shall willingly, willingly devote my life. January, four years since my awakening. My efforts to transfuse the black liquid into the body are at the precipice of success. The womb is the key. A pure soul proves to be a highly malleable and adaptive subject. Oh, okay. So they, that's what I want the president's daughter, dude. See, I didn't read this kind of stuff when I played when I was younger on the GameCube version. I just played. I didn't read this stuff. I never. And then Resident Evil 2, which is my favorite one, the PlayStation 1 version, my favorite Resident Evil, Resident Evil 2, never read a, a word in that game. I was just a kid just shooting zombies. I didn't read nothing. I don't know the story for real enough, right still. All right, January, six years since my awakening. I have named these sacred larvae carried. All right. I have named these sacred larvae carried in the wombs of the chosen. You too, after my own. They shall carry the prestige of my family name as if I had spawned them of my own flesh. As babies. Oh, okay. The you too are now close to the size of an adult humans. The size of adult humans and they continue to feed and multiply. I have successfully created new species. Master Ramon has recognized my efforts, efforts and blessed me with his praise. He has taken to you two calling them no, Navis, Navis the door, Navis the door? Navis the door, Navis the door. Okay, the meaning, the unseen. I've been told that his Holiness, Lord Sadler himself, has expressed pleasure with my work. What an extraordinary honor this is. I can hardly see the tip of my quill through the tears of joy. His humble servant, Estadro Yonarta Tarvaria. I don't know how this. Yonarta Tarvaria. So he, obviously, he loves Ramon. I hate him, but his his name on the other game was like um. I liked him better in the GameCube version. The game, the GameCube version, I liked him better. I liked him better. Damn, I'm getting tall. Wearing these headphones makes it my speech just kind of. Oh, I don't know. Just messes with my speech. This part was different than the other ones too. That's cool when he's close up on you. It's like a real kind of gun situation thing. Like when you're when he's close up on you, like he holds the gun like he's on you. So that's pretty awesome. I love that. I noticed that earlier in the game. I was like, damn, man, it's so real, dude. Like the way games are nowadays, man. Oh no. Boy. Oh, 
Bye. I love the striker, dude. I'll be honest. And yeah, we got herb. We got some herb. Let's eat this egg. Yeah, actually. And for real, eggs are our superfood. Don't let no one tell you any different. Eggs are a superfood. I make my family eat eggs, dude. I do. I don't feel bad about it. I'm telling my daughter that you have to eat this egg. Like, eat your eggs. <laughs> hey, eat your eggs. So I'm always saying that to her. Hey, eat your, eat your, eat your beef. Finish your beef. <laughs> I don't like my beef. I'm like, girl, sorry, you ain't gonna get no, uh, you know, her little dessert. She likes this little, it's like a, it's not healthy, but it's like a healthier ice cream. Like Harry Potter. We're just right now I'm just trying to gather some some resources. Alright, you just told me to throw the dust away. So we'll go there. That's what I hate about these newer games though. Like they tell you what to do. They hold your hand too much. That's what I liked about Elden Ring, dude. Elden Ring did not hold your hand for nothing. See? Went up 50%. Just one herb fills me up like almost all the way. Heavy grenade. Can't go wrong with a heavy grenade. I should have kind of powered up my knife a little bit. Even though it's pretty strong, I should have. Oh my goodness gracious. Merchant. What do we need? Should we do anything? Can we make anything? Let's make some more shotgun shells. Actually, no, let's make some rifle ammo, dude. We don't. Sorry. We already had some, but I didn't see that. Show up this ladder. Oh, he looks. Do they keep coming? Do they not stop coming or something? Like, 
I'm trying to loop this whole room, dude. <laughs> Okay, so we got one more gig to do. Okay, so then, yeah, okay, there's more of them. There's plenty of more bugs. So. Let's load up. Still got like a little more than half body armor, health left. That's, this game, dude, this game makes it hard for real. This is the hard, this is, this game's awesome. It's not easy, it's, it's super hard to be honest. They don't give you a lot of ammo. They don't hold, they hold your hand a little bit, trying to tell you where to go as far as like the next step, I think. But uh, they don't give you a lot of like a lot of ammo. They don't spoil you with that. They make it so you have to keep repairing your body armor and your knife and all that stuff. They make it so you keep upgrading your guns. They make it challenging, I'll be honest. It's not easy, but it's not hard same time if it makes sense so hardcore mode this is just standard mode hardcore mode is probably freaking hardcore dude that's probably the perfect name for it right <laughs> hardcore step back man oh gosh the first aid spread. I'm trying to save those beakers for uh, yellow herbs. Alright. Straight up the case. Like I said, I'm OCD with this. So that's where the gate is. Gotta open the other one. I hear a bug behind me. Yeah. Yeah. How long has this been going? 24 minutes, guys. I'll make this 30 minutes. I'll make this 30 minutes. We got six minutes left. Let's see. Let's try to make something happen. Where are we going? 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 I feel like I'm not done the ball right yet. I don't, know, I don't know why I'm going there yet. I feel like I'm not done here yet. That's what I started at. Let's just backtrack real quick. I get myself hyped up for some squats, man. I always get nervous on squat night, on squat day. Sundays, every Sunday squat day for me. Always get that nervous feeling in my stomach. I just procrastinated all day. Oh, here we go, got a box, see? I knew I was forgetting something. Yeah, I gotta get everything, man. I'm that guy, I have to get everything. I guess this is the way I'm supposed to go anyway, I think. Ooh, red herb, see? Yep, there's the other gate. No, we don't put that one here. There's the switch. I do got me a nice, delicious Jocko energy drink I'm gonna have before my workout, and then I have a nice, delicious Kill Cliff. Energy drink. I am gonna devour both of those before and after my workout. 
And then I'll probably have like a nice little cheat meal, like a little cheat, cheat snack. I'm gonna grab these cookies. I don't know if I wanna make those or not. They're like healthier. I mean, there's no such thing as a healthy cookie, but they're just that. They're just made with all natural ingredients. The worst part about it is it's got cane sugar in it, but you know, what can you do? It's either that, I'll probably have that for my uh, cheat meal or some sourdough with some butter and honey on it. I'm kind of leaning towards that. Have like four or five pieces of some sourdough with some honey and butter on it, dude. Oh my gosh. I probably will do that. Yeah, I think I'm gonna do that. Cause the cookies, I'll feel terrible about it. Like I'll, it, it'll, it'll kind of, it'll bother me for days. Like you eat those cookies, dude. You eat those cookies. That's what I'm telling you, my conscience, dude, that he's ruthless. Ruthless. I cannot enjoy anything. Even when I'm enjoying stuff, my conscience will kind of torture me about it. <laughs> All right, we're coming up into this some crazy looking room. So yeah, they want me to lower the drawbridge. And it's obvious, like, come on. Um, okay. So the drawbridge didn't come down all the way. Assuming. Um, okay, so they didn't make it that, that easy. I feel like some weight has to come down on that before it comes down. Okay, they got yellow paint right there. What do you want me to do? I see. See, that's what I'm talking about, man. But I, I'm, I th I'm thankful, but damn, you just told me. Put yellow paint all over stuff. That's what they want you to do. They, the stuff you're supposed to do, they just soak it in yellow paint. Basically, it's like fucking some Splatoon guys came and Splatooned that area and just, you know, that's where they want you to go. Oh, well, you better get back. Oh, no. Okay. Stay away from me. Me too. Stink ass feet. Oh, no. I see the guys. Get some help. Well, we're not saving those. Ah! Ah! <laughs> no, run, Leon. Damn, bro. Run. Oh my 
gosh, dude. Kill these guys. Kill them. Kill them. This guy's just bad. Guys, I'm gonna have to end it after this. Give me some nightmares! Oh no! Run! Run, man! Go! Go! Oh my gosh. Let's heal up. Can we craft that too and make it full? Cool. Come on, Leon. Let's get this ammo real quick. You wanna run out? Run. Oh gosh, get off me, bro. I'm really, I'm literally at the edge of my seat. Guys, this is gonna take, what is it, we have 30, oh gosh, no, I just turned around to look at the audience, man. Go! This ain't good. This ain't good, this ain't good. This ain't good, I died. Well, I think we're gonna call it for the night on that. I gotta do squats.